Follow me, kids. Huh? Yo, lady, the museum door is that way. Yes, it is, but you aren't like the other kids. Oh, no, no, no. You need to see something special. <laughs> right through that door. Huh? You're seeing things, lady. Am I? Or are you not seeing things? Whoa. Come on. <laughs> Now, today is November 2nd. Does anyone here know why that date is important? Taco Tuesday! <laughs> no. Gorge yourself on Halloween candy day? Nope. Today is the Day of the Dead. Wait, is that like National Zombie Day or something? <laughs> <laughs> you can't go this way. You will get us both in trouble. Ancient rules of the, uh, the museum, administration. <sighs> well. I suppose I could turn a blind eye, my <laughs> dear. <laughs> Behold, children, the glorious beauty of Mexico! Whoa. This place is loco. So many. Oh, at least that part is lame. <laughs> Whoa. What is this book? That is the Book of Life. All the world is made of stories, and all of those stories are right here. This book holds many truths. Some are actually true. <laughs> the Battle of Sink. Go de mayo? Mayo! I love mayo. <laughs> and some, not so much. El Chupacabras? The legendary goat sucker? I have to keep one. <laughs> <laughs> now, although you may doubt some of these stories, there is one thing that we know for certain. Mexico is the center of the universe. And long ago, in the center of Mexico was the quaint little town of San Angel. Cheros! Cheros! Frosted churros! Now, naturally, since San Angel was the center of the universe, directly below it lay the land of the remembered, a festive and magical place for those who live on in the memories of their loved ones. <laughs> and below that lies the land of the forgotten, the sad and lonely destination for those poor souls who are no longer remembered. But before I can properly begin our story, you need to meet the two magical rulers of these realms. Who is that? That is La Muerte. She is made out of sweet sugar candy. She's so pretty. She is, isn't she? She loves all mankind and believes that their hearts are pure and true. And that is Zibalba. That charming rascal thinks mankind is not so pure, just like him. He looks spooky. Yes, he's made out of tar and everything icky in the whole world. He's so pretty. <laughs> uh, what about the weirdo with the beardo? <laughs> well, that is the candle maker. He keeps everything in balance. He is made out of wax and has a beard full of clouds. Clouds? <laughs> all right, let me show you something else. See, all of these wooden figures here, they represent real people in our story, just like you and me. Whoa. And so our tale begins on the day the people of Mexico call the Day of the Dead. No retreat, no surrender! <laughs> 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 